Okay, welcome to painting with Heidi. Hi. Just need to put on the paint. You gonna pick your colors? Which colors are you gonna which colors are you gonna pick today? Like a, lot of, like a lot of greens? And uh, I don't know which color. This is in pink and blue and red and yellow. Okay, well, let's start mixing your paints. But you need to squeeze a little bit so there's a lot of room. So. Well, good, you got the lid off. You just need that much. Just a little bit of green. I'm doing it in the color order I put it in. But starting with the green. Be careful with that one, because that one's got a lot in it, huh? Mm -hmm. So, that's a big hole, so make sure not to... Did you make that hole with a drill? No. No? Did oh. someone else make that hole with a drill? Uh. It kind of got a big lump, huh? I want to mix that one around, because I want to see what color it makes. Like, those two greens. Mm. This is so hard. Good thing I got red fingernails. Okay, that's probably good. We gotta have enough paint for our next show. Mm -hmm. So, but next time I'm still gonna use paint of that color. I don't know. I think that's that uh, dark, a darker red. Mm-hmm. Well, yes, the pink is not what you did, uh, so I'll put that no, back in. No pink, maybe blue. They're not too much. <laughs> Sometimes you add too much with the big one. Yeah, just gotta be careful. There's this little thing that comes out with these two. Helps you open it? Yeah. Hmm. It's very helpful, huh? But the other one, uh, there's this little thing that has small. Hmm, that might be empty. <laughs> yep, sounds empty. Hmm. Just doesn't want to come out? No. It's like the snail that doesn't want to come out of its shell. It wants to stay in there where it's warm and safe. Uh, guess this one doesn't want to work. No, so no, I'll no. try another red. So you've got yellow, right? Oh, yeah, maybe yeah. that red will work. Smaller red, hmm. a harder red to open. Oh, that yellow one that's biggest, and it has a, a picture of a banana on it. Hmm. You think it tastes like bananas? Nope. You sure? Yep. Okay, that's probably good with red. Yep. Good that's little amount there. 
Oh. You got your banana color. Yeah. Now you gotta put banana down. Uh, that's. Be bopping banana. Oh. <laughs> well, banana. there you go. That was quick. Yeah. Does that answer the question? It's gonna work. So, what are you gonna paint today? Mixing there. Yep. Yeah. It makes a little bit darker green. Just a little bit. So it kind of like gray and green makes it. Well, why do you wash it off? Because so the other colors don't mix with that color. Oh, very smart. Who taught you that? Mm -hmm. It just made sense? Yeah. Mm. Well, I think uh, I thought that I should do that. And make sure to put on too much water because uh, if you add on too much water, then that will get the paint off like this. Mm. But there's a little bit left. If it's sticking, no, well, I think you're good. Make your first line. Uh, which color did I use first? Um, there's a dark. I just uh, all random pictures. Prints, but I was thinking of it, and if the paint has too much paint, then you could just dip it into one of them like that, mm. and then and you can paint some Chinese on there. You don't have to if you don't want to. <laughs> it's all your picture. You go for it. for the blue. Um, so, uh, me and Chinese. Mm, me and Chinese, huh? Is That's that you? how you spell wa. Wa. That's me and Chinese. Mm, very cool. some yellow. I'm drawing a banana. A banana, huh? Because every picture needs a good banana, huh? Yeah. Wouldn't be a picture without a banana. Well, if you have a banana color, then if you, you have a banana. banana.
water, huh? Yep. Cool. So what does this picture mean, Heidi? Uh, uh, tell me what it, some Chinese. Tell me what it means. What does the picture mean? What are the things? What are the different things in it mean? Uh, some uh, uh, all the spread is of uh, a two-headed uh, Chinese dragon. Two-headed Chinese dragon, huh? And like the like the uh, dragon with the salt and pepper shaker there. But he doesn't have two heads. He only has one head. Yeah, but. It, a Chinese game. And uh, all the bread is birds. Birds, huh? And all of the green is all of the clouds. And the gray is the thing that the dragon is coming at. <laughs> and there's a banana. <laughs> Yep, every picture needs a banana, right? Almost every picture. Yeah. Some people don't want bananas in their picture. But they should have bananas because then they'd be all be happier, wouldn't they? Yep. Everybody had a banana in their picture, they'd be happy. But that will only... What's that? I do not know. Oh, you do not know. You just made it. Yep. I guess this is my uh, Chinese imaginary friend. <laughs> I oh. just wanted to paint it on my picture. Oh, very cool. And you got to put your initials on the side of it? Right here's a boat. <laughs> there's a boat. So that, you got a boat that. and a banana, and you got a Chinese dragon, you got water, you got a symbol for me, you got your Chinese imaginary friend. All sorts of stuff. Yep. And that's a boat. <laughs> and that's a boat, painting lots of boats. It looks like your paper's full. Is your paper full? Well, there's some spaces that I haven't painted. Mm. Oh. Oh, some yeah. more gray in there. This was a little red. If you paint on the red, then that will just make it gray. I'm making the gray more color. So it will be colored in. Oh, very nice. All right. Well, this has been Painting with Heidi. <laughs> Thank you for joining Heidi with her exploration into painting. And don't forget to subscribe. See you Bye. next time.